Hi student, today we are going to discuss about the preparation of nitroalkanes. Nitroalkanes, first method from alkyl halides. Alkyl halides in laboratory methods. The preparation of nitroalkane from alkyl halide in laboratory methods. So in, in this method, we are taking the alkyl halides like alkyl bromides, alkyl iodides. The alkyl halides on heating with the ethanolic solution of potassium nitrite gives nitroalkanes. Here we are taking the alkyl halides like a alkyl bromide and alkyl iodide. Here we are taking CH3, CH2, Br. So we are taking the CH3, CH2, Br. So the name of this compound is ethyl bromide. Ethyl bromide or we can say bromoethane. Ethyl bromide. This is alkyl halide. We are taking the alkyl halides on heating with the ethanolic solution of potassium nitrite. Ethanolic solution of potassium nitrite. Here we are heating it with the potassium nitrite KNO2. Nitrite. Nitrate means NO2. Nitrate means NO3. So in the presence of ethanol, we are heating. So in this reaction follows SN2 mechanism, SN2 mechanism, SN2 mechanism. Here the elimination of potassium and bromine, the potassium and bromine goes as a potassium bromide, the potassium and bromine goes as a potassium bromide minus KBr, it gives nitroethane here the remaining CH3 CH2 and the NO2 CH3 CH2 NO2 this is the nitroethane nitroethane then plus potassium bromide potassium bromide this is the first method preparation of nitro alkanes from alkyl halides in laboratory method so in this laboratory methods we are taking alkyl halide like a ethyl bromide ethyl iodide this alkyl halide on heating with the potassium nitrite this is the potassium potassium nitrite potassium nitrate this reaction follows SN2 mechanism gives nitroethane gives nitroethane and the potassium bromide so this reaction follows SN2 mechanism but uh, this method is not suitable for preparing nitrobenzene because the bromine attached directly to the benzene ring we are we cannot prepare nitrobenzene by this method this is a halobenzene or bromobenzene the bromine attached to the carbon this carbon the bond is very strong the carbon bromine bond is very strong the breaking of this bond is very difficult it is very strong bond the breaking uh, breaking of bond will be very difficult so this method is not suitable for preparing nitrobenzene nitrobenzene because the bromine directly attached to the benzene ring cannot be cleaved easily the bromine attached to the benzene ring cannot be uh, breaking very easily so it is very very difficult it is a very strong bond the carbon bromine is a very strong bond so we cannot break so if we break we need a more amount of energy so 
we cannot prepare nitro benzene by this method by this methods this is the first method for preparation of nitro alkanes from alkyl halides in laboratory methods in laboratory methods okay this is the from alkyl halides the alkyl bromides or iodides on heating with ethanolic solution of potassium nitrate gives nitro alkanes so this reaction follows hessen to mechanism this method is not suitable for preparing nitro benzene because the bromine directly attached to the benzene ring cannot be cleaved easily cannot be cleaved means we cannot break the carbon bromine bond it is a very very difficult okay it is a very strong bond so it is very difficult to break the carbon bromine bond so we cannot prepare nitro benzene by this methods this is the preparation of nitro alkanes from alkyl halide in laboratory methods so i hope do you understand student thank you